Mr. Wonderful here. In this video, I'm gonna share the brutal truths you need to accept to live your best life. Number one, your appearance. How you look, how other people see you. You should start worrying about your appearance when you're in your early 20s. Do you get enough sleep? Do you stay out of the sun? I'm not saying you shouldn't get vitamin D, but if you're gonna get baked in the sun, put on some sunscreen. Think about your skin. What's it gonna look like when you're 50 and 60 years old? You start take care of yourself early, you're gonna look great. Don't eat crap food. Sure, it's fun to eat a burger and all that stuff, that's fine. But think about what you're eating. Lots of fruits and vegetables have a balanced diet. It's not crazy. Everybody tells you this, but it really adds up over the long term. That's very important. Take care of your body, it'll take care of you. Yeah, some exercise isn't gonna hurt you either. That's why I'm walking. I could get one of these golf carts, but I don't wanna be lazy. I wanna walk, get my steps in. I try and do 10,000 steps a day. Every phone will tell you how many steps you're walking. Try for 10,000, 12,000 a day. Very healthy for you long term. There's no better way to start than with today's sponsor, Tees Hanley, guys. I don't just partner with any company. I have to use the products. I don't endorse just anything. I've used Tees Hanley products for years now, and I truly believe that they'll have a positive impact on your appearance and how you feel. Tees Hanley simplifies the process of taking care of your skin. They provide you with all the products you need and nothing you don't. I recommend you start with their level one system, which comes with all the basics. A daily face wash, an exfoliating scrub, a dub dub, an AM moisturizer with SPF 20, I use that every day, that keeps the sun off the dome. Very handy in protecting that dome of desire. You don't want that burnt by the sun, I'll tell you that. And a PM moisturizer. And because Tish Handley is sponsoring today's video, they're offering my viewers a great deal. Just click the link in that description, the first link in the description, and you get 30% off your first box, plus a free gift. Don't miss out on this amazing deal. Click that link and get started today and take care of your own dome. Okay, number two, start investing now. Now, not savings. A savings account is not the same as investing. Investing means you put it into the market, which gives you 8 to 10% a year over your entire lifetime. So if you have an average salary of $58,000 and you try and get 15% of it and put it away, even into a market index, an ETF or something, it'll grow with you. By the way, look at this, crafty. See, I'm conscious of what's here. I want to eat healthy. I'm not going to eat a lot of sugar. I could, but I'm just saying no, no, Nanette. This place is where everybody hangs out during the shoot, get a little energy. But think about what you're eating. Eat an apple, you know, that kind of thing. Another very important point is you want to build your knowledge. You want to build what you enjoy learning about. You constantly want to be finding out new information. And that's why it's important to find something in life that you want to work on that you're passionate about because you want to learn more. That's the whole idea. So if you love what you do and you want to become better at it, you never stop learning. You want to build that knowledge base up. That's the strategy. Become an expert in your field and well known for that matter. And the more time passes, the more you learn, the more you actually educate because you want to. Listen, you don't want to miss these last few points. They really matter. Set a goal and achieve it. Set another goal, achieve that. Set another goal, achieve it. Do it in steps. And your overall goal, set yourself free. If you're an entrepreneur, it's not about the pursuit of money. That's greed, nothing to do with it. It's the pursuit of personal freedom. You wanna pursue personal freedom to have control over your time later in life and provide for your family, of course. But it doesn't mean you have to have a flashy car, you have to be you know, covered in diamonds. That's nothing to do with it. Having control of your own time is really, in my view, the definition of success. And you have to pursue that. And of course, it involves financial freedom, but not the greed of money. Pursuing money just for the sake of having it, you'll never get there. That's the trouble is you never have enough. But in life, you don't need that much. Once you decide what your lifestyle should be, you build it for that. Keep your connections. In other words, your network of people. Stay close with them. In your life, you'll meet thousands of people, but only 20 of them are going to become your close friends. Work on those relationships. Make sure that you keep in touch. It's good for business too, but also your family. Spend enough time with them. Now, if you're an entrepreneur, you're gonna be working your ass off. I know that, you don't have to tell me that. 
But I stay in touch with my family, I stay close with my friends, and I nurture those relationships. You know, I work harder today than I ever have because I like to work. It's the pursuit I wanted. I enjoy supporting entrepreneurs. I enjoy doing Shark Tank. I do the things I care about. That's what you want for yourself too.